Hello, welcome back to Danganronpa, Alter to Spare Girls. We are in this, um, seems like some sort of sanctuary for the, for the adults being hunted down by the warriors of Ho. Why, hello there. Yes. You must be new. I hope we get along well together. Yeah, same here. Is now really the time for friendly greetings stuffed inside this dust-covered hole? Well, there's nowhere else to go. You guys saw how terrible they are, right? To actually kill people for fun. They're all insane. I hate them. Even if they're kids, if they pushed me. You what? You're just sitting around waiting for an opportunity to fight back? Is that it? No. It'd be reckless to attack now. They have an army of Monokumas. We couldn't win. Yeah, so just as I thought. You're all talk. I figured. What's with you guys? If you're just here to offend people, then goodbye. <laughs> okay. Just looking at those kinds of people frustrate me. They're just giving up. But that's probably because it can't be helped. It can't be helped? Why? They know how powerless they are. The only thing they can do is admit they can't do anything. And that's why we're all cooped up inside this dust-covered dungeon. I mean, this place is really dusty. I, I might just sneeze. Uh-oh. No, don't! <laughs> Hold it in! It's okay. I got it. I got it. That was close. What a relief. Uh, best not to let uh to let Jack loose in a place like this. Hmm. Oh, there's someone we can talk to. Um, are you hurt? Are you okay? Uh, it's pretty bad, don't you think? The kids did it. If Shirakuma hadn't been there to save me, I would have been. He risked his life. Shirakuma. Shirakuma saved our lives. If he weren't around, everyone here would be dead by now. Mm. You saw his wounds, right? He got those trying to help us all. I mm. can't thank him enough. <laughs> Sounds Actually, like thanking a Monokuma. Don't do that! Don't lump him in with the other Monokumas! Oh, jeez. Toko, you don't have to be so prickly. Yeah. I just said how I feel. Jeez, what kind of world is this? I guess... Damn, I, I guess I, I, I understand how Toko feels. She's... After, after what she had been through in the... In Danganronpa 1. But... Ones who just came in look pretty young. You better not be on the side of the kids. Uh, of course not. Exactly what part of this voluptuous body is childish? <laughs> well, if Shirakuma brought you guys, we don't have to worry. We can trust him. Were you also brought here by Shirakuma? Yeah, all the people here were. We were all saved by Shirakuma. Oh, hey, sorry to be rude, but I don't really feel like talking. You can chat with someone else. See ya. Was that guy in a bad mood or something? Hm. He just doesn't understand, acting all aloof. He doesn't know real cool. <laughs> what, like your master? I want Master Byakuya <laughs> to teach him a lesson. Yes. Wait, no. I want Master Byakuya to teach me a lesson. <laughs> Guys, find yourself a girl who who likes you as Toko likes Biakia. Then again, I don't know if it's more uh, if it's.
it's more uh, Yandere stalkerish at times. Where am I supposed to? Maybe I need to. Okay, D did I talk to everyone I can? I think so. Maybe we could talk to Shirakuma again. So, everyone here is so nice, there's nothing to worry about, right? If these irritating cowards are nice people, <laughs> this world must not be made up of bad people. And that stranger danger warning would no longer be needed. <laughs> wow, such an amazing world. That's the epitome of my ideal. I was being sarcastic. <laughs> As, as she is 99% of the time. Well then, it's about time we went back to the important stuff. This place is used as a conference room, so let's talk inside. usually here though he who's not here the leader of the resistance i wanted to introduce you guys to him hmm. can you wait here a little while i'm sure he'll be back soon leader he's probably some old geezer who thinks he can run the show i won't hold my breath what kind of leader would a pitiful place like this even have definitely a useless old man if he really is a superior man, he would be in a superior organization, just like Master. <laughs> and you shouldn't have high expectations either, Omaru. Expectations? What kind of expectations? Yeah, really. How high can they be? Can you wait here a little while? I'm sure he'll be back soon. I guess. Hmm. Let's snoop through the lockers. Oh. Okay. Shirakuma brought in three new people. I feel happy, but at the same time, scared. wonder how many adults are killed above ground. How many of them got saved? How many bodies are lying? Thanks to the newbies screaming, sleepless nights continue. From what I can tell, in his dream, his friend gets killed by kids, and he screams out. I can, I can kind of understand how he feels. I can't blame him. The newbie finally broke. Even though he's a grown adult, he ended up acting like a newborn baby. He lost against the nightmares. The kids. Looking at the scenery forces me to realize that even though I'm here, I couldn't run. Every time a newbie's brought in, my despair increases. I can't even run, nor forget. The children will kill us all. Ugh. This is pretty... intense. Reading it makes me dizzy. Hmm. Quick fire skill increases laser sight and reach speed slightly. Sounds good to me. Everyone is dead. Everyone got killed. The sound of the chanting, the screaming like dogs being choked. Never leaves my ears. Everyone got killed. Everyone got killed. Devils. They're devils in the bodies of children. Damn devils. Damn devils, damn devils, damn devils. I want to grind down your organs, your heart, liver, your kidneys, everything into dust. I want to throw you all into a blender and turn you into sloshy livestock feed. I want to stab your eyeballs with a pencil until I can write with your blood. I want to boil you alive in a pressure cooker until your screams stop. I want to squeeze your little bodies until blood leaks from every pore in your skin. 
I want to slash open the wombs of the mothers that birth you and stuff you back in. Jesus. <laughs> Whoa. The writing's really sloppy after this. I can't read it. That's quite a poetic style they have there. Quite. List of victims. Names of the dead are listed here. List of missing. Names of the missing are listed here. The victims and the missing are divided into two lists. They're both pretty long. It's not even murder at this point. This is war. The kids call it revolution. That's just semantics. Exactly. Call it whatever name you please. In the end, there's still a mountain of bodies. But by calling it a revolution, they justify it in their minds and become even more brutal. By how you're talking, you seem to know these brats pretty well. You're talking about the warriors of hope who lead the Monokuma kids, right? From what I know, they were apparently students of an elementary school affiliated with Hope's Peak. Yeah, that's what I got. That's what it sounded like from them, too. Hope's Peak Academy? Why would that name come up now? What about it? Did something happen before? Not just something. But forget about it for now. It's a very long story. Yeah, go brush up on Danganronpa 1. But more on the subject, I never expected the Academy to also have an elementary. They're not technically affiliated. Attending Hope's Peak Academy still requires being scouted. But the elementary was still prestigious. Many Hope's Peak Academy students came from there. The elementary studied the talents of children. Only child prodigies could attend. And how exactly are they prodigies? They're just a bunch of mental brats. I guess that just shows that having a great mind does not always make a great person or a child. A child's talent can easily be corrupted into something evil. Those five are the worst example. Actually, the warriors of hope were all in the classroom with the trouble children. The trouble children? Troublemakers, huh? Just as I thought. They were all deviants from the start. It might be more accurate to say that they own talent not even the teachers could control. And what makes it more horrifying is that they're still kids. They kill without guilt or mercy. You remember what you were like when you were children? How many cruel things you did? Insane because they're too pure. Uncontrollable because they're too innocent. Children with more potential than adults. With such cruel natures. How horrifying it would be if they were truly out of control. Toa City is an example of that. You... You think it's fun to threaten us? It's not like that. I'm just trying to tell you to be careful. Hm. That's none of your business. Oh. Yo, Shirakuma. I heard you were looking for me. Uh, oh, I did. are you the? I heard you went outside again without my permission. Didn't I tell you it's dangerous? So, two more newcomers? This guy's... Name's Haiji Toa. Oh. I'm the leader of the resistance here. What a surprise. He's pretty handsome. <laughs> oh. Uh, I'm uh, Toko Toka. Fukawa. I hope we get along well. Well, now, this, this is... I thought you only had eyes for Byakuya. I'm Kamara Nayegi. Uh, um, so, a girl who's filthy, and a girl who's clean. Which one do you think? <laughs> <laughs> wow, Toko, it's already coming um, on to... If your last name is Toa, does that mean that you're... Yeah, I'm from the Toa family. 
Kaiji's father is a chairman of Toa Group. Then you're a son of a distinguished family? And the Toa Group, too. You must be very... Ah, uh, that... So, so apparently Toko just has a fetish for, uh, for guys from powerful families. Ah, I'm getting a little hot from all this excitement. I don't mind if you help me cool. <laughs> Got it. Leave it to my special cooling device. I, I didn't ask you. <laughs> well, I'll tell you right now, I don't have status or money or anything. Those kids took it. Thanks to them, I lost everything. Toa group. Even the whole damn Toa city. Uh, by the way, uh, do you happen to know who's uh, leading the children? Who knows? Then, do you maybe know why Toa city became a target? Sorry, I don't really know much about Toa's situation. Didn't really do anything there. And the one who would have all the answers, my dad. Well, he's been missing since the riots. Missing? Hmm. I, I'm the same. I don't know where my parents are either. So I... I want to go home no matter what. Please, tell me how to get out of this city. Well, if there is a way to escape, I'd love to know. All the roads that connect to the outside are blocked completely. And it wouldn't matter anyway. That wristband. Right. Those kids I was, put I it was on just you, right? gonna say that that wristband kind of uh kind of keeps you from leaving no matter what. I, I know it will explode if I try to leave, but does anyone know how to take it off or something? N no. I want to help, but I'm sorry. It's just not possible. However, no need to get too down about that. At least this place is safe. Those brats don't even know this place exists. Y you're telling us just to hide here? It's not like you can escape anyway. Staying put and keeping quiet is the best move right now. You're... you're right. At least as long as I'm here... There's no need to worry. Why don't you fight? Hmm? Isn't this a resistance? An organization created to fight these little brats, right? Then why don't you just fight? Fight? That'd be suicide. We have no guns. See this arm? Your arm? Did Amonakuma do it? Yeah. Got crushed. Crumbled up like paper. The whole thing only took a split second. And those brats were... laughing. Like it was fun to them. While I was screaming, bleeding. They're not kids. Not anymore. They're devils. Devils? Well... The bright side is, even my nerve endings were crushed, so I don't even feel the pain. Of course, that just means it'll never fully heal. So basically, your will got shattered along with that arm of yours, right? Huh? And that's why you're sitting here, moping and pitying yourself, right? What the? You sure got harsh. Th that nice girl act was just for your benefit. I got information now, using my womanly charm. Huh? An act? Oh. Uh, of course. I belong to Master Biakia only. <laughs> There's no way oh. I'd give my heart to some mole of a man, hiding underground like a coward. It's not like I'm going to hide forever. I'm just waiting for the right opportunity to strike. Save them for your psychiatrist. What's the point of fighting back knowing that you die? It's all for nothing if you're dead. The way you are now, you might as well be. Toko, that's too far! I'm saying it to you too. Huh? 
Weren't you going to fight against those brats? What are you doing sympathizing with these people? Yeah, okay. Maybe you are just an average, common, ordinary character with no special talents. A drab girl who lacks presence and charm with no athletic or intellectual skills. But what's wrong with that? Someone who just keeps making excuses and doesn't even try to fight back? You're worse than dead. Totally worthless. Wh why are you being so cruel? Uh, hey now. I'm sure Toko didn't mean it like that. I, mean, I get, I get oh, where yes, she's I coming from, though. Just looking at you frustrates me. You remind me of myself in the past. <laughs> no matter how much pain or despair you feel, nothing will change if you keep denying it. So why don't you just try to change it yourself? No matter how scary the situation was, he faced it head on and moved forward. Thanks to that, I'm alive today. She's talking about Makoto, isn't she? W what are you talking about? Rushing forward at full speed with no hope of success isn't courage. It's stupidity. Uh, who's stupid? Well, do you have a plan? Do you know of some way to get out of here? Do you know how to remove a wristband? Y yeah of course uh, I I'm sure future foundation technology can get it off easily huh ah uh, I was just uh, saying it's not like we can contact future foundation anyway wait hold on what did you just say about future foundation does he know about them don't tell me you're just gonna leave it up to those guys oh he w what do you mean uh, um Toko is a member of Future Foundation. He doesn't like them, does he? What? What did you say? Hi, G. If that's the case, then I'm sorry, but get the fuck out of here. I refuse to cooperate with you. Uh, hey! It was something about future foundation, apparently. Let's go. Huh? But, uh, he told us to get out. We can't stay here. Y you're right, but. Hmm. I wonder what happened with Haiji. He totally lost his composure back there. Yeah, again, as soon as Future Foundation was mentioned. What is that? <laughs> Someone help! That's my wife! Please, calm down. I okay. can't. I can't just stay calm looking at this! But this at, is a trap. They're static? just trying to flush us out. Why fall for their cheap tricks? Did something happen? It might be better if you guys didn't look. Huh? Why? Just because the adults managed to make their way here, it doesn't mean they're saved. As long as we're helpless against the children, there will be no future for the adults here. But... There's no need for you guys to worry about that. I'm sure you're already troubled enough. Then I won't think about it. W won't do any good anyway. And sorry about earlier. I never thought Haiji would react like that. It seems as if he hates Future Foundation. <laughs> Who cares? I'm not interested in those who are beneath me. Anyway. The exit's over there, right? Huh? Leaving already? You should at least stay the night. If I had to spend a night in this dump, oh, I, I would rather leap into the arms of a Monokuma. <laughs> Aren't you being a bit too dramatic? 
They're probably planning to attack us while we sleep. Or, or take funny pictures of our sleepy faces. <laughs> oh no. A sleeping face shot would be bad. <laughs> but it's already nighttime. And underground, it's going to be even darker. Huh? D dark already? I guess I've got no choice. If you insist. Just for one night. See, this place is a private room. It's usually used for the injured and sick. Private room? No matter what you call it, this is a prison cell. It does kind of look like it. Yeah. No, it's not. It just looks like one. But it's not. Well, you sure about this that? is the only place there is, so we got no choice. Um, about what you mentioned before. Are you really a member of Future Foundation, Toko? So what if I am? And if you make contact with them, they will come and save us? Well, yeah, but reaching them is the problem. It's true that it will be difficult, but it's not impossible. I'd like you to have this. I see. That's it. It's the newest wireless device Togami Group developed. It Togami. can send audio and video. It wasn't available to the public, but groups like the police and Future Foundation use it. So, if we use this, we can call Future Foundation? Really? We can? No, it's not that easy. Because of the jamming. Jamming? Like raspberry? <laughs> There's only one man who would dare give me the raspberry. He means radio interference. Thanks to the signal jamming everywhere in Toa, this device can't be used in town. Oh. Then why give it to us? You want us to throw it away for you or something? No, it's not that. The jamming radio waves are emitted from a huge building called Toa Hills. If you send a signal from a higher spot, you should be able to avoid the jamming. Oh. And of all the buildings in this city, there's one that just might work. And it's not far. A skyscraper called Toa Tower. It's a huge tower, a landmark of Toa City. That building is taller than Toa Hills, so you should be able to send a signal from there. Then... If we go there, we can call Future Foundation? If you already knew about this, why didn't you just use other adults? Why us? It's impossible for anyone here. Monokumas are patrolling outside, after all. Yeah, and they seem pretty, uh, pretty duh. But I've seen you two fight. You can beat those Monokumas and make it to the tower. Yeah. But, but that mole man said he didn't want to rely on Future Foundation. I'm sure he'll understand. If Future Foundation comes, his people will be saved as well. Of course, I won't force you. No doubt about it. This will be a dangerous mission. I wish I could do it myself. To tell you the truth, I'm jealous of you two. I wish I had the power to protect people. It sounds like you've done quite a hey, bit already. Coco. I, I know. You want me to decide, right? Well, it's been decided. Even if a competent adult were to go, it'd be too dangerous. I want to go. What? I know it's dangerous, but we found a way to survive up until now. So, I want to keep trying. Keep going forward. I understand how you feel, but maybe you should think this over. What happened, Toko? Earlier you were telling me to stop hiding and fight back. No, it's just... Well, I guess it's better than just rotting away here. When I think of it that way. Then oh, she likes we are mind. going? For now, we'll check it out. We'll see about contacting Future I'll Foundation ship it. when we're there. 
looks like you made your decision. Thank you so much. I'm grateful for your courage. Well, make sure you get plenty of rest today so you're prepared for tomorrow. Thank you. I'm finally starting to see some hope. Thanks to you, Shirakuma. Shirakuma, Aww. thank you so much. Oh, good for you. A tight and bouncy hug from a high school girl is priceless. <laughs> Again, I ship these two. <laughs> so c cold, Master Byakuya. <laughs> it's morning. Yeah, sure is. Of course, there's no real way to tell underground. But still, I feel refreshed. I was able to get a really good night's sleep. You're the only one who slept well. <laughs> How can you just fall asleep so fast like that? Okay, then. Now I'll tell you how to get to Toa Tower. After you climb the ladder, go the opposite way you came from. That will take you above ground. A little bit past that, there will be a river. Follow the river, and you'll find the tower. Doesn't sound like it's too far away. Th the problem isn't the distance. It's the Monokumas between here and there. Well, it's gonna be all right. I'm sure of it. Why do you say that? You have no reason to think that whatsoever. You're the reason, Toko. You might be worried for whatever reason, but with you around, there's no need to worry. What? That Aww. doesn't even make sense. Aw, she's blushing again. Just leave it to us. We'll definitely get a message off to Future Foundation. You two be careful. Have a safe trip. Hmm. Okay, and with that... Sounds like a good uh, cutoff point. Next time we will we will make our uh, make our journey towards that tower. I'll see you guys then. I'm playing a game.